Hello Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Welcome to your monthly general reading for December 2022. And yes, the year has come to an end already. And um, I hope 2022 has been good for you. And as we enter 2023 Cancer, I hope the year is going to be uh, a better one for all of us. And we are all going to be healthier. And we are going to uh, enjoy life more, okay? So that's what I'm wishing for you. And yes, uh, we've got um, uh, the sexual magic deck here for your love life. And we've got a shadowscape deck for the general reading. So I've already pre-shuffled um, both decks. So let's see the main energy for your love situation, okay? Okay, okay. Yes, let's go for that one. Let's see what the message is for you, Cancer. Main energy. Foundation. Reflection. What can be achieved and moving forward. Okay. So you've got the page of pentacles as the bottom of the deck. Yes, in terms of your love life, it says watching. So cancer. You are being watched or someone is watching you or people are watching you or people are going to be watching you. And also you need to watch yourself, what you're doing, okay, in terms of your love life. Yes, people people are, are interested, are interest, they are interested or it could be that your person is watching you. And they could be thinking of making some changes and that's why they're watching or they are... <laughs> uh they are, they are thinking all sorts of things yeah they could be watching you especially online okay because um yeah this is this is an interesting situation or you could be watching them but i thought you need to watch yourself so we've got the king of wands as your main energy and your foundation is the wheel of fortune Reflection is justice. What can be achieved is the magician. And moving forward is the Ace of Pentacles reversed. Hello, Cancer. This is quite interesting because so far everything is upright except the Ace of Pentacles. But I feel that, you know, it's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. You are Cancer. You can handle it, yeah? Yes, you know, your foundation being the wheel of fortune shows that changes are coming, positive changes are coming. And I feel that as um, the year draws close, you know, everything that you wanted to achieve throughout the year, you are going to be able to achieve because I feel this is an intention that you are going to set to achieve, to complete whatever you started at the beginning of the year, okay? And also, I feel new things are beginning for you. And so, yes, this is this is a fantastic time for you, Cancer. Whatever you do, you can never go wrong because, look, in your reflective uh, corner is the justice card. Here, you are judging yourself and asking yourself, how did I do this year? And you're going to say, after all, I did awesome. Okay? That is how I'm seeing it, you know. Um, it doesn't matter if even people are watching you and judging you. I feel your own judgment for yourself is healthy because you've done well. Oh, cancer. That is how, that's how I see here. You see? 
Your main energy is the king of wands. And as some of you know, the king of wands is both Cancer and Leo. And look at you. You've got all the confidence you need to make the decisions that you need to make. And you will be just, you just be in charge of whatever you want to do. Okay. So I, I, I feel so happy for you that, you know, December is, uh, the year is ending on a very high note for you. Okay. Your confidence, anything, anything you've put your mind to, you are determined to finish it with confidence. Yes, 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 yes. And of course, um, what can be achieved is the magician. Okay. You are going to work tricky situations and you are going to bring your magic on. That is how I'm seeing it. You are totally unstoppable in December. And like I said, everything that you have put your mind to, you are going to achieve it no matter what, because you feel like, yeah, the whole of the year, look at me, anything I set my mind to, I'm going to do it. And I feel you are going to set new goals. Yeah. Set new goals for yourself. And I feel that they are going to be firm ones. Okay. And anything that, you know, um, you have been through throughout the year, I feel like you are going to celebrate it and it's going to be magical. Okay. It's going to be magical and you, you're not even going to, you're not going to stress yourself. Okay. Having this ace of pentacles here, I feel that yes, um, all you need to do, you know, is to make sure that, um, you don't overindulge yourself, you know, in terms of food, in terms of anything to do with your physical body. That is how I'm looking at it here. Um, just make sure that um, if even you gain weight, is is enough for you to be able to <laughs> control yourself. I feel this is all about your physical body and you enjoying the, the rest of the, you know, uh, as the year draws to a close. This is you enjoying yourself. Like, you know, I'm going to have fun. I'm going to spend money. I'm going to, you know, do whatever I want. You know? So just make sure that you are not um, unstable. Or, you know, because people are watching, people are watching. And I feel you are not really bothered about this watching because you've got nothing to hide. You have got nothing to hide. The whole year has been good for you. And look at you in December. You, you are feeling confident. You are feeling solid. Yeah. And so whoever is watching you, this could be people who are jealous of you and seeing and trying to see if they can cause some trouble in your love life. But quite frankly, um cancer i don't think you are bothered i don't think you are bothered because you know what you are doing and you know i feel the only situation you need to be mindful of is the amount of um indulgence and what you are going to be eating and things like that but i feel that you know you will treat yourself you definitely treat yourself and just don't overdo it <laughs> that is how i see it here with this ace of pentacles reversed okay I don't feel it's anything negative um, in terms of finances or anything else or your home. No, I just feel like, you know, your home is going to be uh, like a proper, proper party place and people are going to have fun and you're also going to have fun. But I just feel that that is the only thing. Some of you might gain weight, but, you know, it happened at Christmas. So, so what? Yeah. So, Cancer, I hope this has been insightful for you. And I wish you all the best and I will see you next time or you will see me next time.